sometimes when you want to make some progress, it helps to consult some of the works of the masters. Um, this is a book by Salvador Dali, 50 Secrets of Magic Craftsmanship. And so today we're going to learn from one of the masters. <clears throat> Here then, in all frankness, are exact details, and these constitute secret number nine. You have to fuck when you make your art. Be as chaste as possible. Practice carnal abstinence. Mm, maybe I don't want to read this part. No, I'll keep going. Practice carnal abstinence during the periods when you are not materially launched on your work. That is to say, during the inspiration and the conception of your painting. For during the spiritual process, it is most desirable that the accumulation of your libidinal impulses, unable to find outlet in an actual realization of desires, should nourish the process of your dreams and reveries especially in the state of gestation, which, as Paracelsus said, above all, a state of digestion, of transformation, of transubstantiation. I shall tell you that precisely at the moment of placing yourself really before your canvas in order to begin to paint it, it will be very desirable that you should establish the regular habit of making love once a day at least. Every day. You must fuck. Fuck like rabbits. And note also this, that you must never do it in the morning. And, but immediately after, the slumber with a key. And once more, according to your disposition before going to sleep. Remember then, abstinence during the, the periods of conception and love during your periods of realization. Do not fuck when you're conceiving of your art. But in the six days that you make your masterpiece, you must fuck. For you know already that while you are working, all anxiety must be absent from your spirit, since I have already explained that you must execute your work in a half-waking state, lulled by zephyrs of memories mingled with readings that are sufficiently monotonous that you will barely hear them. Your libido. must come to the canvas. You must be horny for art.